Hello, good morning. My name is Sean Honus. I'm an application consultant here with Synopsys. I'm here today to talk about productivity improvements that we can bring with Synopsys Memory VIP. So, all of the Synopsys VIP is, of course, written in System Verilog. This gives us the ability to compile natively UVM code, and it gives us the ability to run in any simulator. Um, the coverage is implemented with System Verilog cover groups. We bring verification plans. You know our base class library that we implement for all of our interface and bus VIP? That same look and feel, that same base class library is used for all of our different memory VIPs. The DDR4 devices, the, D the DDR4 DIMMs, LPDDR, HBM, all the new flash standards as well. The configuration of a VIP is can be improved when we see all of the timing parameters and all of the configuration parameters of that VIP together. Synopsys has a, has a configuration GUI where we can load, we can load components from the, from the part catalog and view or change all the timing parameters that we're going to use. You can search for them, you can, you can ask the, the, for the documentation from this, all in one, all in one easy location. We also have the ability with the Synopsys VIP to choose and to select on the command line, on the simulator command line at runtime, what part we're going to use. So I can choose a UDIM or I can choose an LRDIM or an RDIM. I can choose densities, speed bins, whatever, on the part. I can essentially select a catalog part from the, from the catalog on the command line. When I, I can also essentially just randomize, say pick a random part from the catalog or pick a random UDIM that's of this speed bin from any vendor with any with any with ECC or not. We also can bring productivity to through the debug process. So I can load my UVM log file into the Verdi protocol analyzer and find the errors. I can navigate to an error. I can see the transactions that are occurring. I can see the bank state of all the of all the banks on this on this dim here and I can see the memory contents on this dim and I can see all color coded the activity I can share this information with another I can select a transaction and see its contents I can understand at a very high level what information is is there and then I can double click down into the waveforms so thanks for joining me for this short introduction you can find out more information about all our VIP at the synopsis website thank you